Yeah, it's a breakfast club, bitches. Who's donkey of the day today? Donkey of the day for Tuesday, December 6th goes to MSCHF. MSCHF is an American art collective uh, based out of Brooklyn, New York. And according to Business Insider, they have, well, they had an installation at Art Basel this past weekend. Y'all know what Art Basel is, right? Mm-hmm. That's where a bunch of people gather to not buy art. Okay, uh, folks just go there for the partying and the networking and to deride Diddy if they get the opportunity. Well, MSCHF had an art installation that was a working, fully functional ATF. But when you used it, it displays how much is in your checking account. I know you're thinking, well, Uncle Charlotte, that's what checking accounts do. But no, this machine displayed it to everyone. Now, the only reason I'm giving MC, MSCHF donkey of the day for this is because they are preying on the fact that we live in a peacock show-and-tell era. Sometimes you have to save people from themselves, and you have to save people from themselves by not giving them the option to make this kind of mistake. Now, if you haven't seen the clip online, it shows people using the ATM, and viewers watched as a screen scrolled through not only bank accounts on a leaderboard, but also showed a photo of the person using the ATM at the moment. I'm not making any of this up. Let's go to 7 News Miami for the report, please. Oh, there's a special ATM that can tell all. Your checkings? Right. All right, yeah. DJ and music producer Diplo used the machine at Art Basel over the weekend, and it shows how much money you have in your bank along with your photo. The creator says it was designed to help people, quote, cut to the chase. The ATM sold for $75,000 to a collector in South Florida who plans to make it available to the public. Why you would want this? I, you know, I, I embarrass yourself. Right. Yeah. There you. Uh, You're the one. There's your bank account. <sighs> now, if you're wondering, it showed someone who had 2.9 million dollars in their checking account. It showed another man who had 48 grand in his bank account. And he couldn't even break into the top 20. Now, if you think MSCHF sound, MSCHF sounds familiar, it's because they were also responsible for Little Nas's ex's Satan shoes. So they know how to do things to get people talking. But this right here, not only do you run the risk of shaming the hell out of somebody at a time when so many folks are facing financial hardship, but I guess if you had Art Basel in Miami, you got a little change to spare, but probably not because so many folks be fronting. But why would you want to publicly embarrass people in this way? Because there are some people on this leaderboard with zero dollars. Okay, mm-hmm. probably because they didn't know it wasn't a typical ATM. They probably put that Chase or Bank of America debit card in there just to check their account. You know what I mean? Next thing you know, their picture is up and everyone in the room knows they have zero dollars. On the flip side, what if you got money? What if you're holding a little something? Okay, you this guy who had $2.9 million. Now everybody there knows you got that kind of money. Now you got a target on your back. You a walking lick, a potential lick, all because of MSCHS activation. I don't want to live in a world... We are well. We are ranking people by their bank account balances. Uh, now, Daniel Greenberg, who is the co-founder of MSCHF, said the ATM leaderboard is an extremely literal distillation of wealth flaunting impulses. From its conception, we had mentally earmarked this work for a location like Miami Basel, a place where there is a, a dense concentration of people renting Lambos and Rolexes. So basically, they knew you idiots couldn't control yourself. And they wanted to expose some of you folks for fronting. The only problem with that is folks that know they are fronting probably won't use the ATM. Can we listen to the clip of someone who used it? I, I, I got this from This Is 50, by the way. This is an ATM where once you put in your debit card, it'll take a picture of you and it'll put your bank account balance on the leaderboards. And it'll rank you among other Art Basel guests to see who has the most money. Currently, number one is $2.9 million dollars. It goes all the way down. I've seen it all the way to like number 79 with zero dollars. A couple of people had zero dollars, but it is just insane. It's a really popular ATM here, as you can see. People are hesitant to put their card in there. The ATM sold for 75000 at Art Basel, and the owner of it can place it wherever he wants. And there will be some idiots who use it because we live in an era where folks just simply love to show off. And like the news reporter said earlier, Why? <laughs> Why would you want to use this? Rich or poor? Why? Does anybody need to know how much dough you hold? I have no idea. Uh, please give MSCHF the sweet sounds of the Hamiltons. You are the donkey of the day. You are the donkey of the day. Yeehaw. Mm-mm.
Donkey of the Day is brought to you by the law office of Michael S. Lamisoff. Don't be a donkey. Dial pound 250 on your cell and say the bull if you've been hurt in a construction accident. That's pound 250 from your cell and say the bull. Wake that ass up. Early in the morning. The Breakfast Club.